Welcome back to MDIS Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to connect Webflow with Stripe. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time in Stripe, I need you to click the Start Now option. And from here, just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Connecting Stripe with Webflow allows you to accept online payments directly to your Webflow site, making it easier to manage e-commerce transactions, donations, or service payments. Now, once you are on the dashboard, I want you to add some elements here to the Webflow. And that's going to be we're creating a form, okay? So look for a form, maybe um, payment section, maybe this one. Maybe um, name, let's try to put in some name. All right, so once you've done that, here we need to create a payment form because when we create a form that users will fill out to make a payment. That includes a uh, field for payment details, amount, name, and email. And of course, we're going to use the Webflow, Webflow's embed component to insert the custom HTML, CSS, and of course, integrate the uh, Stripe's payment details. After creating your form here, we need to go to the uh, Stripe's dashboard. And from here, we need to get the API keys because we will be needing that. This is very important to connect Stripe to Webflow. Now on the Stripe dashboard, you would have the publish publishable key here and the secret keys. But I want you to hover to the developers section, if you haven't already, to find your API keys. It's on the API key section. Navigate to that. And again, it's the same process as earlier. This is going to be the uh, click to copy. But again, you can find it on the home page right here. Right? Go to developers. Click on find key. And we're going to use that later on the uh, web flow now if you find it's a little bit hassle and a drag to connect web flow to stripe or strap to web flow i might suggest to go use the sapiers automation tool all you're gonna do is create an account it's free you can connect Stripe to web flow and automate your work and have all this endless possibilities just click the orange button to connect these apps and you would be forwarded here on the zap which we can of course rename that this is going to be the entire workflow process for this time you can simply create an event all right for example it triggers when a subscription is canceled by a subscriber or due to end of billing period but of course you can uh, choose triggers when a checkout session is completed let's do that and hover to the web flow here you can choose an event for example um, it creates or adds a new item to a given collection or adds a new item to a given collection on your published site after selecting all of these options all you're gonna do is just continue follow the on-screen prompt authenticate these apps and you can sit back and relax because Zapier will do all the work for you all right but if you wanted to have more control on the web of low stripe integration and if you have like a coding background or the technical expertise you might want to choose the flow.ninja itself the integration difficulty is medium all right and you see you can have all these platform and advanced integration right you see it's designed for users with a robust background in web development or access to professional developers. I don't have that, obviously, but of course, if you do have, this is another platform that you might want to um, check. Obviously, we're here to give you methods and explore ways to connect Stripe with Webflow. All right, just go to the Grow My Project and of course, from here, just follow the on-screen prompts. Now, for a much simpler method like Zapier, you might want to check the make. You can connect Stripe and Webflow integrations basically with any of the favorite apps in just few clicks. You see, like Zapier, you can select a trigger. For example, um, triggers when a give, give it event occurs. 
you can select action for the web flow for example this one it creates an asset folder within a given site choose that simply connect these apps no credit card required no time limit on free plan now all you have to do is to connect apps with make or task and workflows to apps and systems just sign it with your google you can use your facebook or github and just follow the on-screen prompt now another option that we can explore is members tag you can integrate your webflow membership with a stripe in minutes so i've used this in the past members tag all you're going to do is you can get started you can copy and paste web flow components but of course you can subscribe to access premium articles but the thing is you need to create an, like a free account or 39 dollars per month but again we are here to show you and explore methods and um, guides on how to connect members tag to stripe as you can see just navigate to settings stripe settings click under that and you connect multiple you can connect multiple accounts importing plans from stripe all right if you don't like this one you might want to choose nna stripe and webflow integration you integrate stripe with webflow to build powerful workflows design automation that extracts you see if you click this option right here get started you have this option you can even switch from webflow to um stripe all they're gonna do is provide your full name company don't worry it's fire it's free there's no credit card required and you can start automating today so i've used this in the past and boy it makes wonders and the last platform that we are going to uh show you is stripe plus web flow integrations using relay.app you can connect for free i've done this uh i tried this and it works all i'm gonna do see this is gonna be all the platforms that you can um, use to automate using their relay app on a separate video, we're going to show you how to connect Stripe with Webflow using Zoho. But of course, um, that's for another video. But if you want to just click on try it for free now, you'll be forwarded here on the Zoho flow for free. Just provide your credentials. If you haven't, just create an account here using the 15-day free trial. Now again, for more advanced users, Stripe provides APIs, keys, and webhooks that allow for custom integrations and automation based on payment events all right because stripes infrastructure is designed to handle high transaction volumes and scale with their business whether you're a startup or a large enterprise stripe can grow with your needs because as your business evolves stripe offers various features such as payment links in-person payments and advanced analytics to meet different requirements and that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one.